clears all eye bags up in here. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Xander, and good morning. Happy Pride to you. Today is Saturday, the 5th of August, meaning it is Brighton Pride here in Brighton. So I've got a jam-packed day. Um, filled with exciting fun activities, most of which involve copious amounts of alcohol. So I'm gonna get my lazy ass up and out of this bed and start getting ready because I've got places to be and people to see. I've managed to get out of bed and have a shower. I can stop being lazy because I'm gonna be fucking late as always. All right, happy Pride. I am out, I am dressed, I am ready to go. My outfit is complete. I am wearing a bum bag, so I'm thoroughly prepared for people to be taking the piss out of me all day for that. Bum bag or no bum bag, have a happy and safe pride. Some may say I am the queen of turning up to things on my own, which is completely true, because, hello this man, I turn up everywhere on my own um, and hope to meet people. So it's gonna be fun. I'm just walking to the His Kind, ooh, happy pride. <laughs> Um, I'm just walking to the His Kind brunch party magazine launch thing now. Um, I'm told there's going to be Prosecco, Vogue dancers and canapes. And hopefully it'll be a chance to meet some nice fun new people. See you later. Called, um, his kind and chappy for hosting the pride brunch that was super fun um, so thank you for that I'm now heading to meet a different group of friends um, and we are gonna head to the park but it's raining it's raining on my parade I think this weather is extremely homophobic and I would like to write a formal letter of complaint to whoever decided it was gonna rain today there's just people everywhere the whole city goes mad for pride so I'm at Free Park Pride Party Drinks with friends. Say hi. Hi friends. These are all the people that I used to work with once upon a time, but now I quit my job because I don't care. <laughs> I mean, wisdom, wisdom comes at a price, but I'll give you this for free. <laughs> Subscribe. Motherfucker. Wow. So I just realized right now that uh, I have actually missed the whole parade, so that is not coming up in the vlog. I can only apologize, but you know what? You've seen one Pride Parade, you've seen them all. I've been to Brian Pride Parade about three times. It is really fun, but not today. <laughs> not today, Satan. So I'm in the <laughs> fucking queue now. It's gonna take about six years because it's about a mile, mile long. But eventually we will get into the park and we will have a fab time and I will see years and years and it will be very gay. So be there or be square. We are finally in the park after about an hour's worth of queuing but we are here. We are at Rome Pride and we are having fun. Let's get a drink. for so long and then we queued to get drinks. I just bought a round of drinks it cost 32 pounds. Ridiculous. So we're sitting down for a hot minute and then let's be honest I'm gonna go to the bear tent. I'm gonna have a dance. I'm gonna have a boogie. I'm gonna find myself a new husband. It's gonna be glam. Welcome to Pride. So 
we are now going to head to the main stage, find a nice spot, ready to see years and years. Uh, very exciting. We're going back to Matt's for a little pit stop, a little pizza, a little pizza party. Salad. Um, before heading to Sink the Pink tonight, which is going to be fun. Hi guys. But until then, hello. Hi. Having McDonald's from Uber Eats. Honestly, I'm about to have a mental breakdown because today was so full on. All I need is some Lady Gaga quality time, a McDonald's, <laughs> cup of tea, another club, no sleep, bus, plane. And then I'm ready to go. We are at Sing the Pink, we have arrived, it is here. Oh, oh, in a Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together and welcome our first contestant tonight. All the way from over there, it's the girl! Yeah. Next up, she's 85% artificial fibers and the largest fire hazard. Okay, it's three o'clock in the absolute morning. I've been drinking for around 16 hours now, and I'm gonna tell you the truth. Sink the pink was fucking lit. It was an experience, and I would thoroughly recommend it to anyone who is thinking about going, you should go. It was really fucking good. All the performers had such an amazing time. They were dancing on stage for like four hours, sweating their tits off, getting everyone lit. So good. I'm definitely going to be going to the one in London. This concludes my Pride vlog, because I cannot physically hold the camera any longer. I'm going to die. I'll see you when I see you. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been Xander at Brighton Pride. Ah.